welcome back to the Gala Empire. And we hope you guys got a lot accomplished. In today's video, guys, if you don't know, if you're not subscribed, we've been how do you call it? Drop, anticipating, yeah. anticipating this video for the since the past week. Right. It is the biggest release of the Air Jordan One silhouette so far this, this year. year. Let right. them know what we're doing. Today we'll be doing the shoe review of the Air Jordan One High OG Retro Rebellion. We're doing it this video right now. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to the channel to be post notified every, every single, single time, time that, that we, we post. post. Yes, because we do post content like this often. often. And you do not want to miss out on any of our content. Exactly. Please don't forget to as well check out our social media at Gala Kicks, at Gala Training to shop with us if you want to cop with us. And don't forget to please check out our website thegalaempire.com yes. exactly guys appreciate you for tuning in let's get right into this let's do it All right, guys, so before we're gonna switch it up this video, of course, we gotta give you that special unboxing because everything about this sneaker is special. If you don't know, it is the Jordan 1 silhouette that got that Jordan got banned from wearing. Let's get right into this unboxing. All right, so guys, first things first, we're going to the box on how it looks. So here's the top of the box with the X, oof, super nice. And then the Nike, look at the Nike check, really nice on In the, gray? Yeah, in gray. Definitely pops out on that black box. And then it says here, the 19, what, 85? 1985 Air Jordan 1, exactly. Right. Opening the lid up. Yeah, opening the Take lid up. Take that lid off. And here is the wrapping paper. The wrapping paper. It shows like giving you that anticipated look as in what the shoes are. No, 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 no. If you look really closely though, it's Jordan's foot. Hold it, hold it, hold it. It's Jordan's foot with the band all red covering up his sneaker right. with the same shoe that is supposed to be in this box. All right. Right. Definitely, definitely a different type of, of, of wrapping going on for here. Very special. nice. Now, we're going to get into the real wrapping with him taking off of the band, showing him wearing it himself. Fire. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of this unwrapping. Like, if each shoe could have this type of significance, I definitely think Jordan would sell even more. And parents have been moving. People have been actually filling these sne sneakers. But the unboxing for this was pretty special. But... Uh-oh, it's time for it. So here is the shoe, guys. So basically what it says on the shoe. All over it. All over it is wearing. They can't they, stop you it, from wearing them. Yes, they can't stop you from wearing them. Um, it, it's very bold on the black, very subtle on the gray, as you can see that. And then the bottom is a nice gray feel to it as well. Give it yes. you a shadow gray, like you said. Definitely, it does give you a shadow vibe. If you like the Air Jordan One shadows, the um the first ones that came out, it does give you that shadow vibe. But other than that. What's your favorite thing about the sneaker? What would you think is your favorite thing? I really feel like I love the details of the sneaker. The I love details. the outs on the back. I love the words on the shoe. I love how everything really does pop out. Also, I love how they do incorporate extra lacings with the white. So I would say I would cop it with the white laces because, you know, it could give that Definitely nice contrast. Definitely give it a different contrast. But I would say that's it's a lot of good things I love. I love shoes that have a lot of significance to it. So it definitely gives me that. But what about you? Honestly, the red back with the X has to be my favorite pair because it just stands out. It makes everybody want to look at the shoe and just be like, what, what's the significance? What's the reason behind the shoe? You right. know, it does give you that alert. It wants it wants you to, it, want, it screams something. Right. You know, it screams something. But other than that, comment down below, guys. What's your favorite thing? I know they didn't drop on sneakers this morning. So let me know if you was able to cop and get these in hand because if you were, you definitely got lucky. All right, guys, before we even get into resale, as you guys can see in the video, we camped out for these sneakers, guys. We were in front of a store since yesterday to secure our spot right in front of the line to make sure that we got this review out for you guys. So if you appreciate this review, please give it a nice thumbs up. Let us know in the comment section down below. You love to these type of videos. And if, if there's any other type of content you would love to see from us, comment it down below as well. But 
That line. Yes, man. That line was super crazy. Guys, we try to always have this good content just for you. So if you are new here and you're watching, please don't forget to like, smash that bell, and subscribe to the channel. We really do appreciate it. But we do. the biggest shocking to me about this shoe was the retail. Like yes. I, I was super shocked to see how retail, the retail was 170. Was 170. Usually with all these details of the of the paper, of the of the box, of the shoe. 200. These, and yes, it's like, always more than the average. Like the Gore-Tex that's oh, been yeah. coming out. Gore-Tex Jordan 1, 200. Yeah. But these retail at 170, I'm like, oh, even better, guys. Even, even better. better. Right. Makes it, it makes it even better. Because I'm not going to lie, man, the dipping that these shoes did right. was immaculate. Right. I couldn't believe it, guys. Today is March 12th. Literally March 2nd to the 4th. We were looking at 800. Buy, buy now. now. Yes, this we were looking at 800 money. buy now. In less than 10 days, they dipped to like 300 where they're sitting right now. Right. Which is ridiculous to me. Comment down below if you guys realize that. If you have. But if you didn't, man, they were crazy. So many people have been backdooring. Right. So many people have been selling early pairs. So many people got fakes. Right. And let us know if you even bought from StockX that high of a price and like lost it because it went down so much exactly guys because if you did i'm sorry but you took man, man we're not going to talk about yes. that but either way the, we, the place that we camped out what well, had a bunch of pairs as you right. can see they had a whole setup in the video that you're watching they had a whole setup they had um they they had an artist come paint out the mural mm -hmm. of of um jordan dunking the ball with the rebellions on it was super fire a beautiful setup Really had to get this on camera for you guys, but anyways, resell. All right, so sell now is going for two thirty five. Remind you, retail was one eighty one, so not bad at all. And the buy now after fee is going for three twenty five. Man, I mean that both of it is good. It's both over um retail, and you can't complain about that. Um, can't complain. Don't know how exactly these will go, but definitely I have a I have a big like feeling that it's gonna be really high in the future because it wasn't that many i mean it was a lot of pairs but not that many stores not that many people was able to get them yes so it, it wasn't was, even a release on sneakers right, and i don't think they they're mentioning sneakers is not going to see a release right so it is going to be something that's good, hard to be attained from today all right guys now that you heard the resale now that we showed you guys the shoe up close to personal i just want to talk to you guys a little bit let me know how you like the type of content we put out into the video actually as in the the setup the the way we were camping out how many people was camping out the line what it was looking like let me know if you like that vlog style type of um type of video because We've been trying to put that, that type of content out, but sometimes it gets hard. Let me know if you if you camp out and, and you sometimes try to record or you forget or stuff like that. Comment it down below. But Yeah, so I would say going into that like as well when it comes to the recording, it is hard because you do come across the people that you know and you come you start talking to them and like we don't have a cameraman at the moment, but we definitely try to record as much as of the journey as well. But we try to share it as much as we can. If you love that and you appreciate that. Man, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to the channel to be post notified every single time, time. that we post. Yes. But one last up close and personal view of the Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG right. Rebellion there, guys. One don't forget to comment down below what was your favorite feature about these shoes. Yes, and one thing I would like to add, comment down below in the comment section down below. If you, which laces would you rock with it? Would you rock the black or would you rock the white? Cause it does come with two laces as well. Inside is plain, all black. It's more so the outsole, the outside of the shoe that's speaking. Right. But comment down below if you would rock these. And if you would, I'm with you. Cause I would rock them too. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, they're super nice. Super nice. But either way, we hope you guys got, got a lot, lot accomplished. accomplished. If you appreciated this video, please don't forget to check us out on social media. At, at Gala Case, at, at Gala, Gala Training. Training. And if you want to shop with us, Please don't forget to check out our website, thegalaempire.com. We hope you guys got a lot accomplished. We'll see you in the next video.